So it's, uh, it's really interesting how these little battles can steer the directions of war. Of course, me growing up in the Soviet Union, we didn't hear much about this battle. Uh, just like you said, millions of Soviets died. All those people in history that you read about dying, those are all civilians, but I mean, not all, but a very large number of them are civilians and their stories, obviously, that's the rooted, the literature, the poetry, the music, just the way people talk, the way they drink vodka, the way they love, uh, the way they hate, the way they fear, that's all like rooted in World War II and World War One, And so, but we never kind of think about Europe and we certainly, growing up didn't think about their role in the United States. All this, there's plenty of stories of heroism in uh, in the Soviet Union, enough to, enough for many lifetimes. So, but it was fascinating to read from a Greek perspective because uh, I, you know, I don't have many Greek friends. I'm hoping to change that. Uh, this is the beginning, there is the beginning of be a, a love affair yeah. <laughs> of your people. <laughs> Uh, yeah. You know, that, likewise, the Americans don't hear about the Soviet contribution to the end of World War II because obviously we became, you know, enemies after that because of the two systems. But yeah, without the Russians, we, World War II wouldn't have been won either. 